So getting some work done here. I finally got my little Conrail SW1500 switcher working. It always worked, but it needed couplers. And I didn't know how to go about doing that. I went to Depot Train and Hobby today. And he, I said, can you give me couplers from this engine? And he says, I sure can. You want the good ones? And I said, absolutely. So I got the good couplers. <laughs> and it's good. We got the good couplers. And it's, and it's good. It works. It's been busy switching out industries all along the railroad. So figured we have central Bev here's some industry statistics on just this little line on this little um alley switching layout here because we've got right now three industries to um switch and that might not sound like a lot but uh it can get a little busy believe it or not <laughs> so we have central Be beverage distributors which is a beer distributor they go about i did the math they process about, eh, I don't know, 4,900 cases of beer a day. So that's roughly two train car box car loads uh, in a, a day for four days. So they go every four days, they get two box cars in and two box cars out. Then the next industry here is Transamerica Distribution Services. They distribute General Motors parts to General Motors dealerships in the region. There are 70 dealerships that they service. I figure that that means about 31,000 parts a week, uh, auto parts, car parts, go through there to the GM dealerships in the region to fix customers' cars. Uh, so that means they roughly have about 10 delivery routes a night. So those are their trucks. They have there's four trucks getting loaded. Then there's three waiting to be loaded. They run a set of doubles down to the southern part of the service area. And then that truck and trailer are, um, that trailer there is a spare and there's a spare tractor. So there's 10, tr there's 10 trucks. They go through two box cars a day. They go five days a week. So every day they get shipped. Then we have our makeup plant here. This plant manufactures cosmetics. Uh, the hopper cars carry in pigments. The box cars carry in containers that the makeup will go in and also ships uh, the finished product out to different distribution warehouses. Uh, the hopper cars carry all the silica and pigments and um, colors. Uh, we also get tanker cars. I don't have any right now, but there's tanker cars down there. They go there. The tanker cars distribute the petroleum-based products that they use in there to make waxes and mix to make thickeners to thicken the pigments to make lipstick and eyeliner and whatever. They make um, makeup for Charlotte Tilbury, uh, Rihanna, uh, Image Skin Care, a whole variety of different lines of high-end lines they make makeup for. Uh, they're, a busy, very, they're a very busy plant right now. They just got switched out. They shipped two boxcars today, and those hopper cars have been waiting to go in since Friday. They are emptying them right now, filling up their silos. They'll probably get them out of there tomorrow. This plant sometimes gets switched out more than once a day. Uh, so we're very busy on the little railroad, on the little switching railroad here. Uh, they need to get some new box cars down at the GM plant. Uh, <clears throat> they just got a delivery of beer from uh, Miller Brewing in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Uh, they shipped out two box cars of empty kegs, one going to Coors Brewery in Golden, Colorado, and another one going to Miller Brewing in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. So that's uh, what's going on in the railroad right now.